Now, your local two weather authority forecast. A good Friday morning. Meteorologist Chase Menendez here. We've been watching a cold front all week, and it's finally on its way through right now, parked about halfway through the basin. And you can see ahead of it a line of clouds and actually some storms being dropped off in front of that as well. Uh, so if you're traveling, getting an early start to some weekend plans, I say look out for those and just be careful. We've also got a couple of weather alerts to look at. A freeze watch for Culberson, Eddy, Loving, and Reeves County, and that extends until 9 a.m. this morning. We've also got a freeze warning right now for the northern part of Lee County, and that extends until about 8 a.m. this morning also. With those freeze watches and warnings, a couple of things to remember. Keep your people, your plants, your pipes, and your pets safe. And uh, if you do that, well, you'll be all right. We also were tracking a wind watch, and that was for the Guadalupe Mountains area. That's all but out of the way with conditions about 24 miles an hour right now. Hour by hour, temperatures looking like, well, here is the cold front. We've got Hobbs at 42 degrees and 58 degrees down there in Dryden. So really you can see quite a difference between those two temperatures and as we go on through the day well that cold front is going to shift off to the southeast and bring our temperatures up just a little bit now that is something to be aware of temperatures right now between 40 and 50 degrees so if you're dropping your children off at the bus stop or you're heading out to work early this morning bring a jacket with you because it is going to be a pretty chilly one temperatures are not expected to rise too much especially compared to yesterday when we went from 40 something to 80 something right now temperatures are expected to get to about 56 degrees by noon dropping off a little bit from 60 down to 59 and uh, after the sun goes down well, things are going to clear up quite nicely. We've got a low pressure system off to the northeast of Oklahoma over there, and that's going to be driving this cold front. And you can see that line of storms and clouds ahead of it as we go into this afternoon. Well, those storms are going to hit about the Houston area. And after that, by about this evening, well, we're going to hit, uh, those storms are going to hit the Gulf Coast area. So if you're traveling out that way, that is something to look out for. Those storms may be kind of intense. So if you're driving, be very careful. We've got a high pressure system setting up after that. That's going to keep our skies clear and here's a look at your seven day forecast temperature is going to be in the mid 50s today and dropping off even more than that into the uh, about 56 degrees as an expected high uh, sunday is going to be a little bit warmer and monday and tuesday in the 70s even with a couple of clouds in there and look at your thanksgiving forecast about mid 60s is what you can expect with uh, some cloudy skies 